something I wanted to do was give like a full base tour. Because uh, making videos of the Valheim content is a little hard because I'm playing for like 10 hours at a time. So it's like, what do you make a video of without it just being 10 hours? So what if I made like a full base tour? All right. We're doing a base tour, okay? This is Valheim. If you've never played, it's an open world survival survival uh, Viking game and you discover the map um, at your own rate. And when you discover a new area, it builds it on your map. So that's why my map looks incomplete because my journey is incomplete at this moment. Um, but right here, I'm currently all the way up on this Northern Island and we are getting ready to fight the bone mass boss. So we have a base up here. We actually have a few bases. Um, and I wanted to show you a little bit. First, we got to eat a little bit, all right? First thing I like to do in the morning as I go into my kitchen, open up the fridge, eat some Queen's Jam, eat some sausage. Uh, I haven't gone shopping in a little bit, so that's all I have in the fridge, so whatever. Anyway, this is our northern base, all right? That's a bonfire. I thought we, okay, listen, I ordered these new chairs for our living room and they didn't get delivered. I thought they were gonna get delivered today. So now I gotta go to the forest and chop down a tree to make my own chairs. Etsy things, am I right? Quick, go to commercial break. All right, uh, we're gonna cut to commercial break real quick. All right, so this is our house. This is where we sleep, right? So the fridge is right there. And this is our closet slash pantry slash garage slash cupboards slash entryway slash buffet slash uh, clothing dresser slash side night table slash kitchen drawers, most right in here. Uh, this is our workbench. This is where we do some of our work. You know, late at night, we're just vibing out to some lo-fi. We got to get work done. It's nice because there's a win window. There's a... Uh, ah, there we go. I love this window. I get to look at and see, and just enjoy the view. You know what I mean? I'm just being very productive, and I, I enjoy this beautiful view out the window. Uh, this is... Uh, our beds. So this is my bed. Skinny Pete. That's me. That's Will's bed. That's Jason's bed. That's who's on this server. So this, this is a chair. Sometimes we like to sit and just kind of have a think. And this is a stage for when we do dance performances. So I'm tired. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just chill. That was a long dance. So this is our base. This is the northern base, all right? And over here we have our our portal where we can travel fast to other places. Excuse me, this is my turnip garden. You may be asking yourself, turnip for what? It's only a Thursday. And my answer to you is, shup. I'll turn up any day I want of the week. This is where I keep the seeds and the fresh grown vegetables. This is where I keep, uh, well, we don't talk about that. This is our workbench. This is our forge workbench. We even have a stone cutter right here. This is our smelter number one, smelter number two. And you may be asking yourself, smelter, I hardly know her. Yes. So now we go over here, uh, enter this room. This says go to the portal house. Let's go to the portal house. On our way. Anyway, so this is our portal house. This is uh, it's like an sort of like the the highway. All right, and you want to go somewhere fast. This is where you go. All right, so this takes us to the east base. Nothing really over there to be seen. It's kind of boring. Trader. That takes us to the trader. Plains. That takes us to the plains base. Bone zone. That takes us to bone zone. And this is Casa. So this is our main base. I'll show you this. All right. So this is our main base. This is where we settled down initially, all right? It's kind of beautiful. We got a lot going on. This is garden one, garden two. This is our workspace. We got some metal. 
some nails, some seeds, smelter, kiln, forge. We got arrows. Keep those here. And this is our cocina. This is where I fill Mary's kitchen. We have a fermenter. Another fermenter, actually. Okay, that's fine. We got some chests over here. Workbench. Same old, same old. And this is Julian's house. Or my house, as I like to call it. Loop around here. This is the dining room and the living room and the kitchen and the back closet and the garage. This is where I keep most of my things. This is uh, my fireplace where I like to keep that uh, deer head. He's fine. He's just taking a nap. Uh, that's Jason's bed. We have sleepovers every night. Walking only zone. Yes, no running in my house. And this is my viewing deck. So let's view. Okay, I'm done viewing. This is usually how I exit my house. I get on this little ridge here. Mm. We're fine. You don't lose any health from jumping in this game. There's no fall damage. Uh, these are our beehives. Sometimes you got to extract honey from them. And then ask how they're doing. Oh, <laughs> they're happy, I swear. Uh, let's ask this one how it's doing. We're on camera. Bees are happy. This is how they, the bees are always happy. This is what they say every single time. This is Will's house. Uh, I'm not allowed in here without permission. There's been some incidences, but you can kind of see some <gasps> cool stuff. You asshole! There. And this is our base. It's kind of boring, kind of cool, whatever. This is where we put our roots down. Now let's head on over to the plains. Oh, so this is our plains house. Bunk bed situation again. Will, Skinny Pete, Jason. Planes are dangerous because there's something called a death mosquito, and death mosquitoes like to bring death upon you. This is the planes cabin. If you hear that buzzing, that means there's a death mosquito right above me. All right, let's try to find the death mosquito just to kind of give him, give him a quick show since we're on MTV here. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's real scary. I do not like him. I wonder if I could light this fire. Let's try to bring him into the fire. Come here, bitch. Hey, we're filming an episode of Cribs. Get it. Ah, <laughs> oh, you idiot. You went into the fire, you dummy. Yeah, he's dead. All right. Anyway, this is a really peaceful, beautiful cabin. I like to get away, come to this cabin, be alone with my thoughts. Just kind of enjoy the scenery. And uh, sometimes if I really need to feel something, I just I'll do a little of that. This is our happy place. So we're back in the portal house. We've checked out the bone zone, we've checked out Casa, and we just checked out planes. Now let's go to the trader so I can show you our friend, AKA the trader. His name's Kip, spelled Q-A-L-P, but it's pronounced Kip. If you mispronounce it, oh, well they call him Haldor in game, but I call him Kip. We're on, we're on a nickname basis. He laughs a lot. And this is Kip's little bitch, Halstein, who's related to a lot of the big loxes over on Plains who have given me a lot of shit. So Halstein knows that me and him got some business to, uh, to figure out at some point. Fucking catch these hands, Halstein. The last area that you have not seen yet is the area of the bird wolf. All right. So, up here is a beautiful, beautiful mountain right next to our house, which we love because I'm, I love mountains. Mountains, I just love them. 
So I'm gonna climb this mountain. There's a there's a couple of bird wolves who live up here. They they usually punk me and beat my ass. Oh, I didn't bring my coat. It's fine. I'm just gonna do a quick little tour. Don't need a coat for the tour. All right. So usually it's pretty peaceful up here. No one bothers me. It's actually kind of nice. You get to come out here. Look at the beautiful view. Just kind of think, you know? And those ones that are going up, up uh, above my head, those are all my thoughts. So when I have a thought that goes up, it says one. Um, but anyway, that's my tour. Thank you for coming to look at my house. Uh, we worked really hard on building it and, uh, Hope you come back again soon. I'm going to just sit here with my thoughts on this beautiful mountain. That's also my backyard. You might be jealous. Well, build a house on it on a mountain. You can have a mountain as a backyard too. Just beware of all, all bird wolves. They're just scary bird wolves. And uh, they, don't, they don't care about you. But I care about you. Thanks for coming.